In this tutorial, I'll show you how to fix the GeForce error code 0x0003. Now, this is relatively straightforward to fix. The first thing we need to do is head over to our start menu and you need to search for device manager and then just head over to the device manager control panel. From this list of options, we need to come down to display adapters and expand this and we need to locate our graphics card within this list. You'll most likely have a NVIDIA graphics card inside of here and we just need to right click on our graphics card, come into update driver and then press search automatically for drivers and just ensure that you're running the latest drivers on your device here and then we can close out of this window and the next thing you'll need to do is head back over to the start menu and this time search for windows defender and then just head over to the windows defender firewall from the left hand side select allow an apple feature through windows defender firewall and then we just need to select change settings and come over to allow another app click on browse and then we need to locate the geoforce application now this is usually saved within your c drive inside of program files come all the way down to NVIDIA Corporation inside of NVIDIA GeForce Experience and if we come down you should have a file in here called NVIDIA GeForce Experience.exe and we simply need to double click on this file click on add and now if we come down this list you'll see NVIDIA GeForce Experience inside of here and we just need to make sure both private and public are ticked in here and then we can hit OK to save these changes and we can close out of this window and the next thing you're going to do is come over to the start menu this time search for services and then head over to the services tab now from here we need to scroll all the way down until we find the nvidia processes which will be in this end section down here and once you've found these three nvidia ones what we need to do is just right click on these individually so first we're going to click on this nvidia display container one and we're going to right click and select restart and once that's complete we're then going to come down to this nvidia framework sdk service and we're going to double click on this and just make sure the service status is set to start so we can just click this start button here and then we can hit ok and we're just going to right click on this one as well and select restart and then lastly we're going to come down to this nvidia local system one and once again just right click on this and select restart so once you've done that we can then close out of this window and we can check to see if that's fixed the issue now if that's still not working the last thing you can do is head back over to the start menu this time search for run and then tap on the run icon inside of here we need to type in percentage sign local app data percentage sign and hit enter then come down to the nvidia corporation folder and come inside of here come inside of nvidia geforce experience and you should see a folder called cef cache and all we're going to do is right click on this folder select the trash icon to delete it and if you get this message saying it can't be deleted then you'll simply need to close down geoforce before trying this step so once you've ensured that geoforce is not running on your computer we can hit try again and as you can see that's now deleted successfully and the very last thing we're going to do is head over to our start menu search for programs and then come over to add or remove programs from this list of applications we need to find geforce so i'm just going to use this search feature at the top here and once you've found the video geforce inside of here select the three little dots and hit uninstall click on uninstall and then just wait a few seconds for this to uninstall from your system and once you've successfully removed geforce we can then close out of this and you need to head over to an internet browser and simply head over to a search engine like google and you're just going to type in geforce download experience and hit enter then come over to this top search result here and we need to click this download now button once the file's downloaded we're simply going to double click on the .exe file and we're just going to follow the steps on the screen to reinstall the application and that's it guys by following all of these steps that should have now fixed the geforce error code if this video did help you then please consider dropping a like and subscribing until next time